With over two decades of combat experience, a 10-year professional career including 20 wins with 14 finishes, Ashley Grimshaw now imparts his high-level knowledge to this country's next generation of MMA champions. Whether it's on the mats or inside the cage, expect unadulterated wisdom from a coach who makes sure he's practicing what he preaches and still gets his hands dirty. This is a day inside the life of one of the sport's best minds. Breakfast, get his hair done, do not wake up his sister, because otherwise I have to get her up, get her breakfast, do her hair in a short amount of time, which we don't have that. And then take him to school, then we come back here, change cars, strip jet, go to the gym, I have pads at 9.30 or 9, depending on what time I get there with Rob, and I've got to coach jiu-jitsu for the boys. Hunter! Solely on striking and jitsu. Because one thing we have in England is a bunch of striking, and jiu jitsu in England is extremely high level. We have some cool, amazing coaches, especially Nogi as well. But don't get me wrong, I'm not saying you should, one should train it. No, of that'd, be, that'd be stupid, right? But like Israel, we train defense. Yeah, there's work rounds to that. Yeah, just work defense. You don't have to be able to do a takedown if you can stop a takedown. Morning. It's ridiculous. What it is, I know what it is, right? They they get the meal preps, they use all the cutlery, and they take it home. Or throw it away. No, they take it home. I know they do. Who's the main culprit? Oh, man, <laughs> Everyone who's got meal prep. <laughs> Everyone in the gym's a culprit, except for me. And Brad. Any sort of science by overtime, what was it the giveaway to that? When everyone they're just tired and they're not sharp and they're not focused. You can just see it. And you just think what, take a weekend, come back. Oh nice. Yeah, the weekend's not gonna kill anyone. And again, it's not gonna affect like anything. Mm. He did tap and he got hyperextended, but the guy kept going when Archie tapped. So the guy took it away. The guy was probably in the side. I'm going away. I'm like, fuck. I've got, I've got a train off this as well. Sparring, card is much better. Because mm. there's no control here. There's no takedown. There's no chill. Mm. If I don't hit a pad, he hits me. And I'm like, alright, we're fighting. I <laughs> said, so when I got a fight, I take it from 3 3 to 3 5. When I got a fight. Sometimes I've spent half the day saying, hey, bring, your hands, bring your hands back. But then I'll say it to them once, and then when they don't do it, I'll go, come. So you really want to get here. Yeah! Good. Um, 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 Hey, you, you got 
one point two. Yeah, yeah, keep your hands up. Hey, we're here. I remember when I broke my hand for that one. Bellator. They did a CT of it. Yeah, they were like, you have two of them. Aching. I've been on go. Yeah, they broke. 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 Yeah, they I switch my hip, I step. Do you notice know how as I step, I force the arm across the leg? Does everyone see that? Yes or no? Yes. Now what? So now what I do is this. I take a shot. I don't do this. All of you are going to do this. This is wrong. I take a shot. That forces his body over. As I force the body over, I look for my hand. There's my dance. Now, depending on how good they are, you may have to go cool. I'm gonna finish this up. Slide, break the neck down. Switch, step over the foot. So now, when you're looking for the foot, don't feel badly about stamping on his Achilles or anything. Because I need to split his legs. Now cross your feet, Mike. Mike wants to cross his feet. I'll stamp on his Achilles to get through. Does that under do you guys understand that? Yes. Sir. You remember, shut up. Yeah, we're not trying to be friends. Especially if this is MMA, yeah? So now I've stepped through and I'm here. Good position. Watch how I, see how I turn my wrist all the way down. And if I like to do it with the uh, 10 finger grip, I find this pretty weak. But why not? Yeah, I can't do this. I, it hurts my hands, he's very good at it. I'll go to Gable, now, what should I do? I fold his chin into his chest, trying to break his neck, forcing him to roll. As he rolls, watch out to run, I drop my shoulder to the mat, blocking his head. I then look up, and I'm tight. Now, uh, guys, come around this side so you can see my face. Don't act in real life. Right, everyone see that. Again, we're just on the neck. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Next thing I do, guys. No, stop for Brandon. Next thing I do. Trying to push his chin. <laughs> 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 oh, I just got Seriously. I push through, and then I put my hands up. That's where the choke comes from. <laughs> 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 